Mondays can be tough, so we try to soften the edges with our pet of the week. Yeah, I think we do pretty well with I this. Think so and too. we want to introduce you to animals available for adoption at various shelters and groups throughout the area. And we want to welcome a new name to the rotation Katzenat. <laughs> Joining us are Kim Sendik McMillan, the owner of Katzenat in Wexford, and Victoria Wolf, president of Just for the Love of Cats. We have to say great names for both of your organizations. You. Uh, but Victoria, we want to start by you, with you uh, by learning a little bit more about who you brought with you. Yeah, so this is Copper. She's about two years old. Um, we pulled her from a trailer out in Butler with 44 other cats. Wow. Oh my gosh. Yeah, so um, she's up at Cats Net now, the lounge, with some of her potential siblings and potential kids, actually. So tell us a little bit about her temperament. Yeah. Like, would she be good with other cats? Would she be good in a family kind of situation with kids? Yeah, so we highly suggest these guys from the hoarding case go into homes with other cats. Yeah. So they've lived with so many other animals that we believe if they go into an individual home, it might be too much of a transition for them. Mm -hmm. so that makes do, sense. Yeah, we do suggest them going with other um, kitties. Oh, <laughs> um, you are an explorer too. Yes, she's yes. So, so sweet, so friendly. Aww. She's so good with everyone that comes to meet, meet her. That's an interesting Yay. thing, though, and it makes a lot of sense that being in another house with other animals or cats is is perfect. So um, let's talk about cats and Ad and how you two work together. We she they, she's our partner for the shelter. She gives us all the kitties that we can have as adoptable pets there for people to see and visit and meet and play with. Aww. And it's wonderful. It's a wonderful experience. And so Cats and Ad is a place where people can meet a pet, fall in love, and adopt. Absolutely. But also, if you just want to hang out. Absolutely. Okay. So we tell us about that. Downstairs, and okay. I have to mention my business partner, Alex Dilatano. She was not here today. So the two of us, we have a boutique downstairs, really fun pet cat themed things for cats and people of all ages and then upstairs are, are all of our adoptable kitties provided by the shelter. You can just relax, play, there's no pressure to adopt so you just come right. and have fun. Right, and, get to, awesome. and just see if you can bond. Absolutely. Because that's sort of the, the difficult thing right. sometimes. You go to a shelter and you're looking at a cat and you visit in a, in a little room or something mm -hmm. but you're, it's not as a relaxed atmosphere. Yeah, they're not in cages, they're not in crates, they're lounging around, people get to relax, they get to relax and it's it's just really, really a lot of fun. We've had a great time. People of all ages, especially families now. A lot of families, a lot of kids coming in. They've never met a cat before, and they're like, ah, and it's kitten season. Oh, oh it's so great. And kittens. really great temperament, just like you said. Um, there's a community day coming up. Hey, Tell yes. us about that. This Sunday coming up, uh -oh. so help me a little bit there. Yeah. We have, so we're going to have a <laughs> Copper. <laughs> come here, Copper. So we're going to have a bunch of okay. um, local vendors come down we're to back. Cats and that. So it's a, basically like a big <laughs> festival type dealio. Um, so a bunch of local people are going to be there, local vendors to support our community as well. Um, okay. So a bunch of fun things for kids, food. <laughs> <laughs> toys, everything like that. And people have been so welcoming to us as a new business, so it's yeah. fun to reach out to local businesses. I love so. to see you two working together yes. and what oh, a benefit to the fantastic. community in so many ways. And we got Copper back. And we got Here Copper we got back. <laughs> Great temperament. And I love it. Perfect. She's just ready to oh. explore. Oh, yeah, she wants to explore. Yeah. Uh, but <laughs> she's all right. Well, the segment's coming to an end, perhaps at the exact right moment. Uh, but anyway, thank you so much for stopping thank in you. and introducing us to Copper, yeah, who is fascinating. You. By I'm the television like, studio. What else can I do? <laughs> She'd make a nice plate. She could live here with you guys. Oh, yeah. she's so oh, cute. You she's can. so cute. Come here, oh. you. <laughs> All right. Well, coming up next week, I don't know if we can keep the cat or not, can we? Are we allowed? I don't know. I don't know right. that I'm doing next this right. <laughs> Oh, you're perfect with her. All right, next week we have a little twist on our pet of the week. We're going to be heading outside with Mikey and her dog Wilson. They're going to be training with Say It Once dog training. And so they're going to be talking about a fun event that's coming up as well and how you can get in on it with your own dog. So look forward to that coming up next week.